Hello everybody, Pazzi here. Welcome to the Lighthouse. This game is still in early access on Steam. So it is still in development. But we're gonna try this out right now. Here we go. Dummy, mommy's sister went to heaven. On the day she went to heaven, the church was filled with bright yellow lilies. And this made your mommy smile. And she looked at me and said she wanted to name you Lily. After the most beautiful flower she ever saw. Daddy, do you think I'm beautiful too? Absolutely. You're the most beautiful girl in the world, Lil. Okay, back to the game. Prologue, James One, Irvine. Two, three, four. We're playing hide and seek. Wait, I'm not ready yet. Okay, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight, nine. Nine and a half. Nine and three quarters. Nine and nine tenths. Ten. Ready or not, here I come. Yeah, here we go. Use WASC to walk around, yeah. Okay, so look in the frame, the picture frame. I am a police officer. So that's me and my daughter in my picture. So that's me and my daughter in the picture. Where are you? Really? Oh! Use the left mouse button to interact with the objects. She was so cute. My first grade report. First gray report. Can we look at the other one? This whole family there. Yeah. Maybe she's hiding behind the couch. Behind the couch? Well, let's take a look. Uh, I'm just gonna sit down for a sec. Oh no. I think I'm ever gonna find Lil. She's such a good hider. <laughs> Can hear you perfectly well. I think you are very close to me right now. Are you really behind the couch? <laughs> or underneath the couch? Yeah, I think it's better now. Maybe she's in the kitchen. Are you in here, Lily? Is that... Are you in here? The closet! You're not in the closet. The storage space. She's not here. Guess I better look somewhere else. <laughs> Lil, here I come. Oh, oh, I can see you, Lily! <laughs> Lil, are you in the bathroom? You in here? Lily, are you in here? Is this a bathroom? Lily? Is the other room? What? Where are you? Is the other door? <whistles> huh? Oh, oh! Lily! Where are you, Lily? Lily? Shit! Don't worry, Lily. I'm coming. She in here? Where am I supposed to go? Are you upstairs, Lily? Huh? What? Oh, what the heck? What the heck is going on here? <laughs> Okay! Never-ending staircase to heaven, to outer space. Shit, come on! This is not normal. Whoa! Lily? Lily. 
<laughs> There's so many lilies in here. Oh, there you are. Are you my lily? I was looking all over for you. How about I push you on the swing, huh? No. What's wrong, Lil? Don't you want to go play with your friends? I haven't been in school and maybe think they forgot about me. Oh, Lil. Who could forget about you? Everyone. But it's okay. I don't feel good anyway. Hey, Lil. What did one ocean say to the other? What? Nothing. It just waved. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? Okay, what is wrong with me, guys? Maybe Lily is gone. Is she dead? She's all in my head. It's all in my mind. This story is going to be a sad one, isn't it? Oh no. Lily? Oh, is that my... I saw that. Daddy, can you open the curtains? Yeah, sure. Are you going to fill the church with yellow lilies for me too? Oh no. <laughs> Lil, you don't need to be thinking about that. It's okay, Daddy. Don't be so sad. <laughs> Daddy, do you still think I'm the most beautiful girl in the world? <laughs> Look, Daddy, it's raining. Man, this is really sad. Poor Lily. Yeah, her head was shaved. This is the funeral. Is that the mother? Is that my wife? Lily Irvine June 6, 1950 February 19, 1957 So 7 years old My head. My head is throbbing. All that alcohol. James? Yeah. What happened? We waited over an hour for you to show up. What, you drank yourself to sleep and forgot to come and visit your daughter's grave? <sighs> okay. Look. Let me start again. 
I'm sorry, it's just... Betty was in tears. And I'm doing everything I can to keep her together. I know it's hard for you guys. But it's the same routine every year, isn't it? Betty brings yellow lilies and you bring the candle. Look, I get it. You don't want to talk to me. But I'm doing this for Lily. And for Betty. Don't let Lily's memory of you burn away like that candle. Be the man she knew when she was alive. Just take care of yourself, James. Oh, shit. Uh. Oh! Oh! Gonna bruise. So Betty is now my ex-wife, and she is with Henry, the one on the phone. Yeah. Betty and me are no longer together. James Irvine, Private Investigator, API. Lily's obituary. Lily Evelyn Irvine, 6, died Tuesday, February 19, 1957, at Rockport Memorial Hospital. Ms. Irvine was born at Rockport Memorial Hospital on June 6, 1950. She attended King Elementary and is survived by her mother, Betty Irvine, and father, James Irvine, a decorated senior detective with the Rockport County Police Department. The funeral services will be held Friday, February 22nd at 2 p.m. at the Pebble Coast Funeral Home in Rockport with Reverend Charlie Jacobs of the First Baptist Church officiating. Dad, I love you. Aww. So drawing. Joseph Jordan case pick up evidence. Okay. Dr. J was up. Lily. They have an investigation. So, yeah. 19th is circled on uh, the calendar. It's a special day. To visit the daughter. Her grave. But looks like I've missed that important location drag myself to sleep I cannot go out of my office I'm stuck in here Can I use it right now? Put it onto the projector. This is actually not a projector, it's a tape player. Distinguished Service Award presented by the State of Maine to James Irvine. Main Police Department, this is to certify that James William Irvine is recognized with the Certification of Valor for Technical Team and Evidence Response Team Services 20 years of service with the Maine Police Department for protecting the lives, property, and constitutional rights of the citizens of Maine. And Portland Board of Private Investigations, Maine State Detective Agency, have conferred upon James Irvine license certification with all the rights and privileges there to pertaining given the 16th day of June, 1959. So, hmm, I wonder why he resigned as a police officer and then became this PI 
Yeah, why did I do that? Is it because of my daughter's death? James, we have worked together for nearly 20 years. Your dedication and services has been exceptional and you have been like a brother to me. We have noticed the excessive drinking and with the loss of Lily and your recent divorce, you have not quite been yourself. I am putting your fellow officers at risk by keeping you here. With the utmost respect, I will be putting you on extended leave until further notice. I hope this gives you the time you need to clear your head. I am always here if you need anything. Sincerely, Jean Ferris. Rawport Police Department. Okay, that explains it. Looks like I got fired. By the department. And then became a PI. So, is that the last article I need to look at? I still cannot leave my office. <laughs> I'm still missing something. What is it? The tape is still playing. Rotate. Okay, what else is here? Oh, another drawer. So, hmm, my ex-wife. The missing part is definitely my ex-wife. I wonder if Henry is my best friend or not. If he feels like he is my friend. <laughs> and possibly my best friend too. Used to be my best friend. Before he took my wife away, my ex-wife, Betty. I guess my excessive drinking was causing a lot of headache. So everybody was trying to uh, get away from me as far away as possible. So I can crouch. Ah, that's the candle. Hello? With the sign, I'm closed. A new Said case. I'm closed. Get out of here. What's this? Is it a new case? Something related to the lighthouse. The name of the game. <laughs> I'm sure the lighthouse is one of the locations in the game. <laughs> For sure. Letter from Elizabeth yeah, Beamont. I'm not doing this. Mr. Irvine, my daughter hasn't come home for two years, three months, and nine days. You see, she went missing at the same time of the West Scott murders, and I believe she was working for them. I've asked the local authorities to look for her. They insist there is no evidence of her being at the Cape Harbor, and they tell me to accept that she may have run off with a man. Happens all the time, especially with young women, they say. I don't know the feeling of losing a child. It's misery. I cannot sleep until I know she is safe, if she is trying to come home, or if she is even alive. Her name is Lily. Again? Help me find her. Look for her at the Cape Harbor Lighthouse, as that is what I believe to be her last no location. Elizabeth Beaumont. A lighthouse. Cape Harbor Lighthouse. So, hmm. She shares the same name as my daughter, Lily. Interesting. Alright, I'm going to the lighthouse, guys. Going lighthouse. to the lighthouse. lighthouse. Yes. I think I remember something about that. Where did I put that? Uh, cabinet. The cabinet? Yeah, you know, there, there's an adventure game back in the 90s that is also called The Lighthouse. That is by Sierra Online. I still have uh, the disc and the big box with me. <laughs> The game also has a baby daughter in it. A missing baby. We have to look for the baby in an alternative world. That is Link with the Lighthouse. Have you guys played that game in the 90s? Murder at Cape Harbor Lighthouse. 
Rockport police found bodies of at Cape Harbor Lighthouse Friday night. Officials are not releasing any details as to what happened yet, but have confirmed the deaths were not accidental. Residents are encouraged to come forward if they have any information. Speculation is rolling around Rockport's very own shipping tycoon family, the Westcotts. The Westcotts own Cape Harbor Lighthouse and several other lighthouse properties in Maine. A representative from the Westcott family is asking the public to respect their privacy. As of now, we do not have any uh, any suspects," said Lieutenant Derry. A Rockport citizen should be on high alert. Police have not ruled out the Vesco family members themselves and are currently investigating those who were in or around the town of Rockport on Friday. So that's also the same time when Lily Lily went missing. Lily Westcott. Interesting. Lily. Laugh. I'm going down right now. Do I need a map? Do I have GPS in the car? Do I know the directions? Welcome to beautiful Maine. Enjoy your stay. I feel like there should be music and sound in this introduction movie, but I'm not hearing anything right now. Maybe it's because the game is still in early access. There's a lighthouse. Looks pretty run down. How many floors? Seven? Yeah, it is pretty tall one. Hmm, kind of weird that the game has no sound right now. Nothing. But silence. Okay, this is as far as I can take you. It's late, but I'll wait here and keep the lights on until you get inside. I think the door is busted. <laughs> 